What's up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Nerd Block for July 2017. Um, so this is supposed to be their big packed box of double the price or whatever uh, or value of their normal stuff to try and make up for the past two months. So we did get this box, I mean it's August now but it's um, not that late. Um, but they're supposed to be keeping up on time and stuff. Um, but who knows what they're going to be doing. But this is the box. Uh, um, open it. And that's what it looks like on the inside. Um, I don't know what the theme is. I know they announced it. But I can't remember at all what it said. Um, but we'll go ahead and start with the shirt. And so. Oh, so it's Star Wars. It says the dark side on it. And of course this is um, supposed to be like Darth Vader's. Um, I don't know what you'd call it. But from his ship. And so it's like Locky when he locks on Luke or whatever. Um, to fire as his X-Wing and stuff when they're in the Death Star Trench. So that's really cool and I like how it's like written dark side looks. Um, kind of like graffiti-ish or uh, um, like a album cover or something like that. Like an old timey. And so that's really cool. I really like that show. It's awesome. And it's Star Wars so it's always awesome. Um, next up we have a Terminator 2 Skynet something. It's a Nerd Block exclusive. Um... But I don't know what it is at all. Um, on the back it's... Uh, oh, they're shot glasses. So, yeah, they're a pack of two shot glasses. So let's see what they are. Um, so they're like... This one at least is like a shiny um, metal look to it or whatever. But it has the robot Terminator head on it there. Then on the back it says T2. I don't know if you can see it in the light. Um, but it says T2 on that one. And then this one, which is a black shot glass, says uh, Skynet on it with uh, Neural Net Based Artificial Intelligence, Cyberdyne System Corporation, and then T2 again on the back of that. So we got two shot glasses. I really like the color of this one. It's real dirty though. Um, but I like the like weird, like shiny metal, color, like chrome version of that. Um, but those are both really cool. I mean, it's uh, Terminator, so I don't, I don't like Terminator that much. Um, but they're still pretty cool. I like the look and design of them. Next up, we have a vinyl, vinyl mates, a Diamond Select Toys vinyl mates, and it is a Mass Predator, of course, from Predator, and it has um, Nerd Block there on it. So I um, assume maybe the Mass thing is what makes this an exclusive. Not exactly sure. Um, but we've got a couple, or at least one of these mini mates in the past. A um, Ghostbuster is what we got in the past. So let's look. So there is the Predator. He looks really good. And these are like, they're like weird um, Lego, I call them like Lego versions, but they're like, so they have like um, square and blockiness. So his legs you can see are squared off and his arms and his body looks kind of like a big Lego character. Uh, but there's a Predator, so of course he has like the two like um, sword knife things on his arms. His helmet, he has his gun, shoulder gun. Um, and there's not much else. So it looks like he's bare, like their normal bare chest. Then of course he has the ropes and stuff with what looks like skull pieces and stuff on it. And then he just has the little chest armor part there. Um, but I thought they... So this one doesn't show. I thought like the last one came with a gun. So I thought he would have like a stick or something. But I don't see anything in there. Um, but it's still cool. Like I like, I like the Predator. So that's going to be a cool thing um, to just sit somewhere. Um, but that was cool. Uh, next up, we have an umbrella. So we got an umbrella like this in a box not too long ago. But this one is obviously designed different. You can't see... So I'm going to open an umbrella in the house again. So let's see what this one has on it. Whoops. Oh, it's all weird shaped. I can't see what it says. I think it says Carrie. Oh, uh, yeah, Carrie. So it must be um, obviously from the Carrie movie with all the um, blood that <laughs> pours down onto the pig's blood stuff. So it's probably just supposed to be a umbrella. Um, related to that. And I don't know if this has anything um, else related to it, like if it does anything special, because it's just very plain and just says carry right there on it. Um, so we'll have to look at the book thing or whatever if we get one and see if there's anything special about the umbrella. Uh, but it's got like a nice like handle design and stuff on it. Um, we'll just have to look and see what is with that. Uh, next up it looks like we have a um, 
a pin, which is one I think we've gotten before, but it's the Back to the Future, um, the Future license plate that's like the um, barcode. And I, like I said, I think we've got that before. If not, we've got the um, regular out of time one. But either way, I think we've got that before. Next up, we have what looks to be a lunch bag, but it's an X Files um, says custody or chain of custody molder. Um, so again, from X Files, and so it looks it's like it's supposed to be a brown paper bag, and that's somewhat what it feels like. But it's um, got insulation on the inside. I don't know if you can see, um, but it's obviously so you can use it as a lunch bag that's not just a paper but like here it is like a paper material so it means like thicker paper than you would get like a normal brown bag but then you can obviously fold up the top and velcro it down there and then carry lunch it looks like you have a brown paper bag and it has things saying i want to believe is says this is from the sci-fi sci-fi box is what that came from so we got that and then the last thing out of this box is a Star Trek the wit and, or the wit and wisdom of Star Trek um, so obviously it's some sort of book is it like a I don't know what this is um, I assume it's just supposed to be like funny little quotes um, that they have in here from Star Trek and there's pictures and all sorts of stuff like that but that looks like that is everything in the box we didn't get a booklet like and I don't think we got one last time either or no we did um, so I don't know, because this obviously looks like it's a um, mix-up of a bunch of, like, older stuff that's not been, like, we haven't gotten it, well, besides the um, pin, we haven't got any of this stuff before, so I don't know if it's just a bunch of stuff from other... Um, I was going to say, it looks like they're trying to downgrade their stock from yeah. other boxes. Yeah, it looks like it's um, stuff from other boxes that, like I said, they haven't been included in the normal nerd box, so they just grabbed a whole bunch of stuff and stuck it in here um like i said i don't know if the whole value thing is there that they supposedly said because i think it's like um i know it's just double whatever the normal value is so i think it's usually like sixty dollars that they promise supposedly but this so this would be i think they said more like uh ninety or a hundred um i don't really see them here especially if it's old recycled stuff but i would have at least liked a book but if it is just a mix-up of old stuff, um, I kind of understand why they don't have a book because they just kind of threw a whole bunch of stuff together. Um, but what was your favorite item out of this box, bro? Uh, the Predator. Yeah, I would say definitely the Predator. I really like the shirt, too. Oh, it's down. Um, but I really like the um, Darth Vader, yeah, the, the Star Wars shirt because I never get a lot of Star Wars stuff. And I love Star Wars, so I want to wear Star Wars stuff. But we, like I said, we hardly ever get any. So something like that's awesome. So these two are probably definitely my favorite. Um, but that's going to be it for the nerd block. Like I said, I have no clue what exactly is going on. I thought there was still a theme, but it looks like it's just a bunch of random stuff. Um, and I don't, like I said, I don't know exactly what's going on with the box. But at least we got it closer on time. But that's going to be it for this nerd block. So if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below. And hit the red subscribe button to see more. And we'll see you next time. Oh,